how do I sound? Do I, is am I okay? The mic is still like here where my hand is, but it's like lower down, so you can't see it. But can you hear me better? No. Oh wait, sound is fine. It's the same, same as before. You can't hear me. Okay, I'm a mong. Okay. All right, great. You sound louder, but still a little nasal. Yeah. Well, I mean. I I am a little bit congested still, but not super. I sound divine. I sound angrier, okay. I mean, I am pretty angry. I'm, I'm pretty angry, and let me tell you why. Because yesterday, we um we had another pistastrophe just before we ended. And you know what? We're restarting from the start again. We're, we have to we have to figure out this toilet situation because it's no good. All of our water is contaminated now. We have to restart. Yeah. We have to do a GG, yes. Yeah, Spurs lost yesterday, is that why I'm angry? Fuck, I haven't been keeping up, actually. I haven't looked at my fantasy team for a couple of weeks now. I lost I lost the uh, motivation to do it. I don't know why. Just chuck the piss jugs into the empty lot, way of the road. <laughs> yeah, I know, I need to do that, right? A nice snot rocket right into the mic would be great, okay? If I sneeze, I'll sneeze down right into the mic, okay? Doing great. All right, so we're going to do a new game. We have to do a new one. We're gonna do a standard new game. I got some tea, actually. Mm. Starting the stream with the tea in the Dale K mug. Look at the mug that Dale K sent me. What a nice guy, eh? Hey, I'm new to your stream. Saw some of the vids, and you were awesome. Ready for another piss-filled adventure? Hey, Madumi, welcome. Gosh damn. Do we get new people anymore? I'm a huge has been. I mean, I used to be like a really prolific in the Minecraft scene on YouTube. I had 2 million subs. I was like top of my game. It's all gone downhill. Like, I don't think new people find me anymore. Or if they do find me, they just think I'm a fucking asshole. So they don't watch. So uh, maybe that's it. Maybe we're just like on the... We're, we're on the down now. Maybe we're on the down and out. Who knows? Maybe like this time next year, I won't even be streaming or anything anymore. I'll have to rotate back into the real world. It's a big shit sandwich. We all got to take a bite. But this guy's going to end up taking the biggest bite, right? No? More rocks? I'm old hat. Yeah, that's true, yeah. I think people stay because you're an asshole. <laughs> right, okay. Nice. All right, so we have somebody who's good at digging. But she's biohazardous, which is no good. So we want somebody who has plus five digging. That would be great. But not biohazardous. Uh, tinkering, creativity, and cooking. Digging, tick. Tinkering, learning, and creativity, but narcoleptic. Not the best. Athletics, cooking, ranching, and construction with a small bladder, but uncultured. So will never, never do any art. Herald. All right. I think we'll keep... Well, we can do better, right? Minus five athletics. No. Cooking, creativity, and kindness. We don't need cooking um, to start with. Construction, creativity, and strength. Buff. Um, and won't do any combat. Okay, Hassan, you're in. All right, we need somebody who can do uh, digging. Plus four digging, plus four learning, plus three cooking, and plus one ranching with a small bladder, bladder but is a uh, gourmet. Cooking plus three and food benefit minus one. Nails. All right, you're in as well. So we have construction, we have digging, we have cooking as well, and we have learning too, which is great. Um, we probably want somebody who can do learning and learning and kindness. Great, Lindsay, germ resistant. That is fantastic. This duplicate has deep seated distrust of the culinary arts. Will not do cooking. All right, cool. All right, so we're gonna call this one um, impenetrable supernova. No, we're gonna. Hello, we're gonna call this one. Peter Penny Whacker's Gambit. There we go. Peter Penny Whacker's Gambit. We're ready to embark. We'll play on medium speed now, I think, as well. I think it's time for us to play on medium speed. Okay, we're off to a great start here. We have a lot of metal. Uh, we have a little bit of water here. There's a couple of pockets of water up here. There's nothing below us, which is nice. That's, that's, that's good for a change. Um, let's dig out to the water. We'll dig out to the water, and then let's also dig out this way a bit, too. 
Okay, we have to. We got to get this. We got to get these toilets online ASAP. And also, when it comes to plumbing them, we got to make sure that they never get clogged up or backed up or out of order because we've had some real piss problems. Like they've been the worst, actually. These these piss problems have been pretty damn bad. It's got to be said. We have to try to avoid all of these piss problems. Hi guys, how's everybody doing? The video game. We're all good. How are you doing? What sort of job would you have if you weren't a professional dirt producer? Man, I don't know. At this point in my life, I have no idea. I don't know what I would do. I don't know if like I don't know if I ever want to work in an office again. Like I've done my time in an office. I'm done. I hate office culture. I hated all the people that I worked with, more or less. And uh, I never want to work there. So like I don't know, maybe like a grocery store or something. I think I'd be happy working in a grocery store. I think that'd be fine. All right. Let's get a pitcher pump set up here. We'll get our pitcher pump set up for uh, water. And then let's also get some tiles going all the way over here as well. Give these guys some jobs to work on. It'd be pretty nice. Um, we can start one, two, three, four. We can start digging this out down here too. We can maybe put the bathroom down here. So what are we looking at? We're looking at a door. So there's a wash basin, wash basin, toilet and toilet okay we can go to like here I think that should be fine and then we can try to put like a wall like here too okay and then we'll build a ladder that goes down here as well so that people can actually go into the water if they need to yes you get on government welfare and play games for a living that's a great idea maybe I should go on government welfare I don't think it's quite at that point yet but maybe that can be my fallback maybe like I'll just save as much money as I can like top it up like hide it I'll hide all my money uh, in Jersey because <laughs> that's what it's for and um, and then go on government welfare and tell them that I don't actually have any money so I need to be on welfare, but really I don't actually need to be on welfare. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Perfect. Okay, that's great. All right, so let's get a tile here like this, and then we'll make a door. We need some metal for the door. Let's start mining out some of this here. And then we're gonna wanna dig out all this as well. And then we're gonna wanna have our outhouses. We're going to have two. We're going to make two outhouses. And then we got room for a shower at the end there if we want to, which is pretty nice, right? Sips explains fraud. That's right. I am I am fraudulent. I'm a, fr I'm a fraudulent man. I'm always doing the frauds. That's me. That's me. Mr. Fraud Man. Doing all of the frauds. All of the time. Okay, good. So day one, or should I say cycle one, we should have a toilet, so we shouldn't have any piss accidents. That's what we want. We don't want any piss accidents at all in this colony, okay? We're going to do our best to make sure that not a single accidental piss is taken. All right? We want a controlled piss environment. Do you guys agree with that? Yeah? We don't want any more piss pissasters. <laughs> no. You should put on a video on your YouTube to let people know that you're a Twitch girl gamer now. <laughs> I think it's maybe a little bit late for that now, no? Like, I've been do I've been on doing streaming for s such a long time now. I think like the people who care are, are are mostly here. No? No more piss. Yeah, that's right. That's what we're going for. We're going for the no more piss. We don't want any more piss. Medicine, wash basins. Okay, let's get two of these bad boys set up. And then let's also get this door so that we get the morale boost in here as well. Um, okay, and then the next thing we're going to need to do, of course, is uh, build things out so that we have a, um, play, a living place, right? So we're going to go one, two, three, four, five, six. Incredible. Okay, good. We'll have a door here. We'll mine this out. We'll mine this out too. So we're going to want to go up there. And then we're going to have a whole bunch of resources that we can use to build other stuff. 
What a nice sound. You like that, yeah? Or rather chat and you are fun. Thanks. Loved yesterday's podcast. Really, really funny, man. So we recorded the uh, Triforce this morning. Uh, interesting topics we covered. Uh, religion. That was a nice one. It's going to go down really well, I'm sure. Uh, war as well. We talked about the Vietnam War for quite some time, which was also interesting. And um, not to spoil anything too much, but Lewis has been um, reading um, like narrative prompts or story prompts or something on uh, on Reddit, and uh, he complained about them for pretty much the whole podcast. So lots to look forward to, <laughs> lots and lots to look forward to. You guys are in for a real treat. Yeah, did I talk about forty-year-old singles? No, I didn't actually. The topic never came up. I'll save that one for another time. Forty-year-old singles. God, what a rant that was yesterday, eh? Sorry if that offended any of you. If any of you are 40 and single, don't listen to me. Half of it is me not really knowing what I'm talking about, and the other half is me concentrating on a game and really not knowing what I'm talking about. So never take it to heart, okay? You forgive me? Okay, good. Did you start a new colony? Yes, I did. The other one, we had we had too many um, piss disasters, so um, we're, we're starting another one. We're going to start another one from fresh and see if we can avoid piss disasters. We're really, really keen on avoid... Wow! Look, what's all this? Oh, look, there's a whole bunch of oxalite in, like a, in a hearthstone shape. Look, it's like the hearthstone logo. That's really weird, isn't it? I've never seen anything like that. That's nuts. I mean, granted, I've only played like 40 hours of this game, so... You know, maybe you guys have seen crazier things, I'm not sure. No? The Hearthstone new expansion has been confirmed. Um, they released the BlizzCon schedule, and um, they, you know, said that they're going to announce the expansion, the next expansion there. Um, and uh, there's a Diablo What's Next panel, like, first thing after the opening ceremony. So that means that there's going to be a big Diablo announcement. What that means, I have no idea. I mean, would you guys be disappointed if it was like a mobile game, for example? Or like some sort of weird hybrid, like you can play in your downtime on mobile, but then play it on your PC and console or whatever? Because like, it's not going to be enough for it just to be Diablo 4 and the same old, right? It's going to have to be something like brand spanking new. Some, some new ideas have to like be thrown in there, right? Mobile games. Diablo Battle Royale. Yeah. Yeah, and Mike Morheim has stepped down as president of uh, Blizzard as well. And they've put in J. Allen Brack, the, uh, the executive producer of World of Warcraft, has taken his spot. Mike Morheim is going to be a advisor to Blizzard, uh, but he is no longer going to be El Presidente, which is interesting. Um, I don't know how much is realistically going to change off the back of that. I don't think you'll see like any big changes immediately anyway. I'd imagine that at that level, a lot of it is just wheeling and dealing and, you know, forming, like, relationships with other corporations and shit like that. So, I don't know. Maybe not. Diablo Stone. XCOM is a battle royale with two teams, though. Nice. World of Diablo crap. Is the Whacker going to join us in Red Dead 2? Yeah, without a doubt. We're going to definitely play that game. I'm looking forward to it, actually. I think it's going to be a really good one. All right, we want to uh, dig down a little bit more, I think. Um, we need to start getting some um, stuff made so that we can produce oxygen. And we need to start scrubbing some CO2 and stuff as well, right? And plus, we want all of this delicious ore down here, too. Need to get rid of this little pocket of water that's developed here as well. Which is a bit of a pain in the butt. He's looking forward to Ashley. What's that? I don't know. Speaking of board games, anyone else hyped for Artifact? I th I'll play a bit of Artifact, I think. I don't know. I think I'm kind of done with card games, though. I don't know. They just, like... I, I, I played enough Hearthstone in my time, and I enjoyed it at, at a time. But I, I just... I don't think I'm, like, that into card games. Like, I'm not... I don't know if I'll play it that much. It's, I, I don't know if card games are really my thing. Like, they're, like they're kind of fun, but I'd rather play, like, uh, some sort of, like, management sim game or something like that, you know? Am I a bit too old for card games at 25? Probably, yeah. I think Diablo 4 should be more realistic and they should make the final boss your mom. I think they should hire you on as the creative director. I think that's 
a fantastic idea. I think it would be such a shame if that idea went to waste. And yeah, I would love to see my mom depicted as a final boss in a um, fantasy RPG. That'd be nuts. Yeah. Uno. Uno. Yeah, that'd be good. Yeah. Hmm. I know, I say I don't like card games, but man, did I ever have fun playing Uno, which is a card game, right? Like, one of the best card games I think I've ever played. So well-balanced, just the perfect game. So much fun, too, if you play it with other people. Holy shit. I wouldn't want to play Uno by myself, though. Imagine playing, like... Imagine Uno had, like, uh, like a serious competitive ladder and stuff like that. Wait, don't tell me. It does have one. Don't tell me. It does. It already has one, right? It has one already. No, there is. Oh my god, <laughs> I would be tempted. Maybe this is the start of my Uno career. Maybe this is maybe this is how I take it to the max. Maybe this is my segue into a different type of living, right? Playing video games for a living, yeah, but playing competitive Uno for a living and making serious bank off of it—that could be something else entirely, right? Should play Exapunks. I tried it. I don't know if I. I I think the idea is cool and stuff, but I don't know if I really want to play it. It's just like, it's too much with like the accompanying documentation and stuff like that. I'm just like, I'm just not interested in it. I don't think anyway. Maybe? No? Uno League Manager 2019 would be the perfect game for Sips. That's something I could get behind for sure, actually. That would be really good. I would love that. Um, we are going to want to build uh, into here as well. We need to start generating some oxygen. So we might as well just start digging all this out too. We want to generate oxygen and we also want to get started on uh, doing some research and shit as well, right? We need to like get a, a hamster wheel and some other stuff in here. Shat film Zuno team. What happened in the last games? We failed. We didn't die, but they were just a mess. So we're starting again. You gonna play any more FIFA? Fucking loved it with Walker. Yeah, we we'll probably play some more FIFA at some point. FIFA is really fun. I enjoyed that. Hmm. T complete. Mm, it's nice. I didn't leave it to get cold either. For once, it's good. Holy crap! <laughs> Holy crap, Aroni! Holy crap, Aroni, Batman! Um, we don't have, um, I guess we're gonna need, like, uh, one or two of these bad boys in here, right? Let's shove them in here. Let's make, let's have, like, an oxygen, uh, producing room. Before we do that, though, we're gonna need some, uh, power. So we're gonna get one of these bad boys in here. Let's get a tiny bad boy in here. Uh, let's get a research station in here, too. And then let's go for, um, two of these. And then let's power the whole shebang up. Perfect. Who's this? Stinky, Gossman, and Ashcan. Um, we um, are now lacking somebody uh, who can do athletics, digging, and ranching with diver's lungs, but unconstructive. So he won't do any building, but that's okay because he can do a lot of digging, which we need. And athletics is pretty good uh, for, um, you know, running around and carrying stuff and putting stuff away and whatnot. Creativity, construction... Okay, we'll take this guy. We've taken him. We're gonna take him. He'll be of some use, at least. We'll build him a bit. I'm sure he'll be of some use, right? This game is so hard. Yeah, it's a, it's a nice one, isn't it? I love all the little dudes and stuff. It goes a lot quicker, obviously, when you play on a quicker speed, too. Like, we're... We don't have to wait so long for things to happen, which is which is good, right? Please make it symmetrical. Okay, we'll try to. I mean, we've kind of failed at that already, but... Well, it's hard to plan a base so ahead of time. And there's a lot of unknowns still in this game for me. There's still a lot of things I'm not quite sure how they work and what I need to do around them or whatever. Like, I can pretty much get to the point, I think, where we plumb in, uh, like, a, a proper bathroom and just about avoid a, a pissageddon. Hopefully, uh, with any luck. But yeah, but otherwise, it's like, it's quite tough. 
a new map. You, can you be in this one too, Red Skeg? Yeah, sure, man. You could be in this one. Who are we gonna make you? You can be, um, you can be this guy. You can be Hassan, Red Skeg, Red Skeg. Okay, there, you're in. <laughs> you're in. Welcome aboard. Do you fight monsters in this game? I think there is combat in it. Um, I mean, you can kill like these little dudes. We don't need to kill them right now, though. Um, but I don't know, maybe there's like um, very hostile like aliens, like the further you deep, you, you dig or whatever. Add my dog to the game. Who is your dog, my cool? Do these guys eat resources? Do they? That's disgusting. Okay, we'll definitely kill them. Okay, we'll kill them in the morning when we wake up. We also have to make a um, bed for trash can there as well. They make coal. They poop co They poop coal! Okay. Let's not kill them then. I'm happy for them to poop coal. That's a good trade-off. I mean, what, what's the worst that they're gonna eat, right? Nothing. Alright, basic farming. Let's go. We'll start doing some researches. We'll start doing some researching. It's gonna be good. It's gonna be great. Lindsay is doing research. Is Lindsay the one that we want doing research? Who's our researcher? Four and four. Lindsay is fine to do research. Okay, that's fine. We can get nails on the research too. Let's slam through the research. They can back each other up. Okay, we're gonna need to build um, some farms and stuff up here. Um, we're gonna want a ladder that goes up to here, like so. And then we can dig this out. We'll get some algae and stuff from there. Some more metal, it's good. The cot. Did I cancel the cot by accident? Oh, shit. Okay, trash can's cot was accidentally cancelled, so we'll prioritize building this. So we have somewhere to sleep tonight. We don't want him to get, like, a sore back. Sore bones. We don't want him to have sore bones and legs and, and a back and stuff. We need him in tip-top shape. There you go, trash can. Welcome aboard. You have your own bed now. I hope you're feeling good about this. I hope this is making you feel great. Okay, we're also going to need to have um, one of these mushers. We're going to put it here. Um, we're going to power it up with some wires. We're going to run the wires... Like so. Up the ladder, baby. No? No sore boners. No, we don't want anyone with a sore boner, that's for sure. Stero dude wanted to be a colonist. All right, Stero dude, you can be our key researcher. Stero dude. Oh man, all these old XCOM names. It's making me really want to play more XCOM. Holy crap! God, did I ever like playing XCOMs? The best. We're gonna play it again really soon, okay? Once we once we kick this addiction, we'll get addicted to XCOM again, okay? It'd be great. Dig all the way down. You want to see? And we can dig kind of far down. We have to be careful with this sludge, though. Um, research, basic farming is complete, so let's get into, part of me, uh, let's get into, um, power regulation? Advanced research straight away. So that we can, um, we can make a, uh, a coal, a coal generator and not have to have somebody running on the hamster wheel forever. Look at all these water bottles that we got here, this is great. It's nice having water bottles. It's carbon dioxide in there. A little bit in there too. This is all oxygen. There's, we don't have any vacuums around here. Not a single one. Okay, that's fine. We're good with that. Okay, we're gonna have to start creating some food. We're gonna have to get somebody on um, on the case with food. Continuous mush bars. Sorry, I just hit the mic. 
Is it still okay? Can I be in it too? I can donate. I have... I can't donate. I have blocked my bank card. Ciro, what the hell, man? How did that happen? Okay, Ciro, you can be nails here. Ciro. You're in. Do you want to be called Ciro the Death, or is it just okay to call you Ciro? I'm going to assume it's just okay to call you Ciro. Yeah? Can't you just piss in jugs like on Trailer Park Boys? You kind of can, yeah. There is, There are a lot of piss jugs in this game. Probably the most in, in, in any game I've ever played. Most games don't have piss jugs in them, but this does. Um, so we want to put in uh, Muckroot. And we also want to put in um, these bars, which somebody ate straight away because it's uh, break time. Name one of the guys Piss Jug. <laughs> I don't want to. I don't want to call somebody Piss Jug. Can I be in? I donated, but I'm a broke ass uni student. Toxicaro. Toxicaro. Sure, you can be in too. You can, you can be the replacement trash can. Toxic. Toxicaro. Okay, Toxicaro. You're in now as well. Stero Dude, Suro, Red Skeg, Toxicaro. Those are our those are our current colonists. There will be more, don't worry. Hey Sips, can I please be a colonist? Sure. I missed out during Rim World. Oh man. Hope you had a good day. Thanks. Glad man. you're back streaming, so I have stuff to watch on night shift. Oh thanks. Thanks, love Firebug. Oh, thanks, Firebug. I appreciate the donation, man. Thank you very much. It's very nice of you. I will definitely name a colonist after you. And um, I'm glad that you're liking the streams. Thanks so much. Can I get a can I get the worst guy whenever a real stinker appears? Give him or her the name Spoofy for all those terrible spoof films you hate, love. Um. Okay. Sure. Sure. I just got a um, message from Terps on WhatsApp that said, "Fuck, I love that game." Terps also a fan. He loves this game. He loves it. What a what a guy, eh? So, no dad decks today, because Terps is, uh, is away. He's in London. He's in London doing some other crap. He's always doing crap, that guy. He's always doing a bunch of crap in London. Have you ever noticed that? Fucking loves London, Terps. Um, why? Okay, we have to dig that. Alright, so hang on a second. So we want one, two, three, four, five... We want this tile like that Sips, and like that. If you can name a piss jug after me, I'll take it. Okay. If not, feel free to slap my name on a sorry son of a bitch. A sorry son of a bitch. All right, sure, Fraggle Rocker. Will do, man. Thank you so much for the bits. I appreciate it. Is his name Turds or Terps? <laughs> I think it could swing either way. I think it's fine to swing either way. I think Turds or Terps is fine. Okay, we want to put in these mush bars as well, right? Store mush bars in here. We'll start getting some. Um, we'll start getting some containers and stuff set up. Research is complete for advanced research, which is good. So let's go power regulation next, and then let's get a supercomputer set up. We also need a jobs board. Nice. Many things to work on, <coughs> which is good. Some gerbs. No, this is Patrick. Can you name one after my friend's dick? His dick is called asshole. Why? Because it reminds him of you. Dick and asshole. <laughs> nice. That's good. I'm glad that uh, somebody thinks of me. Um, even if they're on, like, negative terms. You know? The worst would be if nobody ever thought of me. Right? So even if somebody's thinking of me negatively, I've still won. Right? It's good. A real dad hole. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, that's me. I'm a real dad hole me. No? Maybe. Okay. His name. His name is Mark. Yeah, his name is Mark. You're right. Do I have a ref link for this game? A referral link for this game? No, I don't have a referral link for this game. You can buy it on Steam though. It's on Steam. It's a, a an early access game on Steam. They haven't quite released it yet. Uh, it's been like this for years as well. I guess they're just, they've got a small team working on it. Surprisingly solid. Like, it doesn't have that many issues that I've encountered. Um, and they've added a lot of cool features to it since the last time I played it. 
I currently have workmen in reopening our fireplace and installing a wood burner, but they're very loud. Can you please shout for the rest of the stream so I can drown them out? <laughs> sure. Sure, I can try to. I'm, I'm not feeling like 100% though. I'm only feeling 96% today, so it might be um, it might be hard for me to keep yelling and stuff. Can you guys hear me okay? Uh, do I need to like move the mic? The mic is starting to bug me a bit. I might just move it up anyway because it's kind of like in the way of stuff. Can I put it here? Is that okay? I liked it better when it was here. Float the mic. Okay, I'm gonna float the mic. I much I much prefer it here. It was like in in front of things that I look at, so I was like having to go like that and stuff. Oh, you, know? you missed Michael. Who's Michael? Who is Michael and what does he do? Food. Planter box. Okay, we're gonna get some planter boxes set up in here. It's gonna be our farming level. Uh, that research is done, so that's good. We want to prioritize this so that we can get... And then we want to prioritize this a little bit higher than the other ones too. Yeah. <laughs> Do a taint tingly voice. And then Mike needs more googly eyes. Okay. You mean my donger? Yeah, that's... Well, like... I need to make sure that it's okay, so I have to look at it quite often. I need to make sure that it's still there, and it's functional, and it can do the things that my donger needs to do. If I can't check up on it, it's like having a small kid. So I have a small dong. Um, yeah, I constantly have to check on it. Yeah. Did the toilets defeat me again? Yeah, they did. They got all blocked up. The system didn't work. We had blockages in the in the in the pipe work. And uh, the toilets were out of order for such a long time. And then um, we managed to um, have a lot of piss in the base. Which is no good. Nobody wants piss in the base. And that's what happened. And that's the story of the time we were overwhelmed by piss in our base. Okay. We have a lot of jobs here for people to do. And... With any luck, they will get through these jobs. We're going to probably need, like, one or two more duplicates, I think. Just to get on top of all this stuff. I'm just going to close all these messages here as well. It's because you didn't hire me as your prime piss boy, the goat wizard. That's probably why. You know, you're right. You're right. We probably should have hired you as prime piss boy. You really missed a trick there. Okay, good. Let's get all these bad boys planted. It'll be good. <gasps> Ooh. Oh, hang on a second. I have to quickly reply to an email. Let me just see. Hang on a second. Don't don't watch what I'm typing here. God, Gmail tries to, like, finish off the words that you're typing now. Okay, sorry about that. I had to do that. We're good, though, now. Sure does. Sending nudes. Yeah, no, it was good. It's, um, it's for a thing. It's for a, 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 a like, an exclusive thing that, um, that I'm gonna do. I'm not sure if I'm allowed to say what it's for. Um, but it'll be fun, I'm sure. It'll be fun. It'll be like next week? Maybe the week after, I think? It'll be good. It'll be fun. It's a game that we've played before that we liked. Yeah? There's an embargo, yeah. Purchasing that penis pump that's on sale. That's exactly it, yeah. It's, uh, somebody outbid me on eBay, so I had to go in and make a, a, make a very bold power move to make sure that I got that butt plug and dildo that I was after. You can separate your beds into rooms to make the zones. I think this has made the zone. So we have a bedroom. Or is it a barracks? Barracks. We have a latrine as well. So I think that's fine. Am I, I mean, the way that I do rooms, is it is it fine? Is it... It's okay, right? Four high is fine. Leaves, leaves enough room for everything. Get paintings in on top and stuff. No? 
it good to have things on the floor? Not really. You want to try to clean them up and store them. We'll make a storage area soon. Once we start getting some of these other jobs done. We'll get on it. Research. Um, we have the jobs board now. So we need to set somebody as a research assistant. We'll make Suro. Suro, you're going to be our research assistant. Okay. You got this. I believe in you. We're also going to want to have an apprentice miner. Uh, and it's going to be Toxicaro. Um, Redskeg, you can be our apprentice architect. And um, we need a cook as well. It's not Suro. Um, an art student? Art student? Redskeg? No. Okay, we're fine for jobs for now. We don't need an art student just yet. We need to get our miner upgraded so that we can mine some of this other stuff, like on the side. Like, we're going to get really close to this soon. Carbon dioxide, polluted water, and a Paku. What do I need to do with a Paku? Can I, can I take a Paku and put him into, like, another tank? Cooking, digging, and kindness with irritable bowel. Germ resistant, which is good, though. We need somebody who can cook, I guess, right? So we're going to get Gene. We're going to get Gene in with the cooking. Irritable bowel means that um, need a little extra time to do their business. Bathroom hustle is minus 50%. Okay. All right, Gene, welcome aboard. You're in. We now have a Gene. This is great. It's going really well. We'll go down and get these two, right? More seeds. Ho oh, Dad, hello Eagle Eye. How are you? I'm a terrible cook and would love to have a colonist named after me. Crad Cradrock. Okay. Sure. You can have this guy. Crad Rock. Cradrock. We'll even give you the sous chef position, Cradrock. With your three skills in cooking. Okay, so priorities then. Cradrock, you are our cook. I don't want anyone else cooking. Just Cradrock. We have enough food for now anyway, but you can always make some more. Firebug Spoofy and another name. Oh yeah, Firebug and Spoofy we need to name as well. Don't worry, we'll get more guys in. We'll get a couple. A couple to start with. Um, this needs to be powered. It's not right now. And then we should be able to research, um, internal combustion. Next. So that we can get a, um, a coal generator. There's a lot of coal around here, and I think we've dug up quite a bit of coal, too. So that's good. So we'll have, like, a power room down here. And then in here we'll just have a whole bunch of, like, uh, algae things algae terrariums to eat up all the CO2 that's going to inevitably just fall down. We need to be producing more oxygen, but that'll help with oxygen production and then it'll go into here. We just got to get the pressure up in the base. Where's the piss pit? We haven't started building it yet. Don't worry though, we are going to build a gigantic piss pit very soon. It'll be one of the next things that we start doing. And then we can start getting into sanitation. Finally get this toilet perfectly perfectly um, efficient and working so that we don't have any big piss problems. That would be the best, right? That's the ideal solution. In terms of gas, what do we have around here? We don't have anything that I can see yet. It looks like there's like a bit of hydrogen there. For the most part, it's just like a bunch of gross stuff. So if I want to start like getting some of this slime and removing the slime lung from it, I got to do it with chlorine, right? Chlorine is the way to to clean the slime of slime lung so that we can then take it and process it into algae. An ore scrubber. Last colony died because your piss pit wasn't big enough. Okay, we'll make sure that th this piss pit is 
absolutely huge, okay? We're gonna make a very big piss pit here. Make sure that this is the biggest piss pit you've ever seen. Cradrock, look at you go. Look at you nursing that poop out of that thing. It's amazing, look at this. I love the little animations and stuff too. There's a lot to love in this game, isn't there? There's a lot there's a lot to love. It's really good. Who is our who is our miner again? Mining? Digging. Toxicaro is the apprentice miner. We want to make sure that he's doing that as a top priority. So we need to we need to make sure that we have these resources, right? And the better he gets at doing this, the he can move up and he can mine other things with the red laser and stuff. So that's good. The last colony drowned in an overflowing piss pit? Yeah, more or less it did, yeah. All of our water sources were contaminated with so many piss germs, it was unbelievable. So it would ju I just decided to restart. We're going to try, try to have another go at, at getting the perfect toilet set up. That's like our first thing. I think if we could get to that point where we have the perfect toilet set up, we're good. We're golden. No? What is this big egg? And what do I do with it? It's one of these guys, isn't it? Is it one of these guys? A hatch. This is a sage hatchling egg. It's a thick egg. You pray to it and make an omelette. We can make an omelette with that egg? That's pretty good. So what, these guys just lay eggs and we can collect the eggs and make omelettes? This game should be called Piss Included. Yes, I, <laughs> we've established that, yeah. How do you use TTS? The limit is high because we used to get spammed a lot with it. So it's like 10 pounds for it to trigger. It's quite high. Maybe it's a dinosaur egg? Fuck, I hope it's a dinosaur egg. That'd be great, right? Who doesn't like dinosaurs? Am I right? Is it, or is it just me who doesn't like them? I don't, I don't have a lot of time for dinosaurs. I think, like, they're okay. They're alright. New base again. <laughs> yep. New base again. Yesterday's base, um, we had too many, too many piss outbursts and uh, all of our water was all filled with piss germs and stuff, so we're starting again. We're trying to, we're trying to learn from our previous mistakes, even though we made the same mistake twice with the, uh, with the bathroom situation. We didn't have an overflow, so it was all, the whole system was clogged up. It was a disaster. So we're going to try to do better today. Yeah? 10 pounds is too much? Yeah, I know. It was by design, though. We made it too much to uh, discourage people from donating. <laughs> what the, the fuck? TTS. You don't have time for dinosaurs. No! Who the fuck do you think you are, hubbub? You big jabroni. Okay, bye. They call me Dinosaur Hater 69 xxx on the internet. That's what, that's, that's, that's my call sign. That's what I'm known as. I'm known as the, the dinosaur hater. I hate them. I hate them. Do we have an architect? Yeah, we do. Red Skeg. All right, Red, Red Skeg. That's it. You're in trouble now, mister, because you should be building. We need you building, all right? Not running on the wheel, for Christ's sake. We got Stero Dude down here doing the building that Red Skeg is supposed to be doing, even though we set him to a high priority. He's not doing it. 10 pounds is 20 bucks in New Zealand. That's crazy. Make it one pound and you'll make more money. Yeah, I know, but then I have to listen to a fucking computer voice constantly, constantly, constantly talking to me. Like, it, would, it, it was non-stop when we had it lower. But I appreciate the advice. Thanks. Research complete. Um, okay, internal combustion is done. So we want to start working on... Um, ventilation. We probably want to get to pressure management next, right? That would be a good one. Make it 999. Okay. 
You're so hyped for Sterodude 1v9ing all of the XCOM maps again. I know. Fucking Sterodude was a beast when we played XCOM. It was great. He, we had him as the, um... What, what class was that again? The, um... The one that looked like a, like a, like a Destiny 2 Titan. And he had that, that cool melee ability and stuff. That was awesome. Templar, that's right. Yeah, it was really good. My cool. Thanks for the bits, man. I appreciate it. Tyler, thanks so much for donation as well. The Death Star is flat. Yeah, no, it, it, it probably is. When you're standing on it, it feels really flat, so it must be flat, right? Except for if there's a hill on the Death Star. It's not, like, totally flat, but, but you know. But otherwise, yeah, I agree. I, I think it is. I think it is flat. It's good. What is it that is ten pounds? Ten pounds is the amount of uh, money you need to donate to make uh, the robot voice work on this channel. I know it's it's a high amount. It's a high threshold. But like I said, when it was lower, it was just constant, and it and it really opened it up to people like uh, just spamming junk like. I'm a sprinkler sips with these long ass messages and stuff so we raised the limit right do you guys remember that do you remember all the subnautica tts catastrophe yeah subnautica actually it was while we were playing subnautica that we decided to to raise it to 10 because we were trying to um read and and listen to things and every fucking two seconds it was just constant I don't know if you guys remember. Now only I can spam feels bad man. S P S P S P S P S P S. Okay, sorry, love you lots. Okay, my cool. Thanks so much, man. I appreciate it. S P S P S P S P S P. All right, so we're gonna make a couple of these uh, terrariums down here. We're gonna make like uh, a bunch to eat hey, up all of this CO2 down here. Liquid tuning has a heater. This will kill the germs. Keep pumping all the pumpers, Dad. Liquid tuning has a heater. This will kill the germs. Keep pumping all the pumpers. All right, Grechevik. Thanks for the heads up. And thanks so much for the donation as well. I appreciate it. Thank you. Okay, liquid tuning, you said. Okay, we're going to go into hey, pressure Michael, management. I challenge you. It's like a, like a throttled reading of <laughs> lemon balls. Thanks very much. I appreciate it. S K S K S K S K S K S K S K S K S K S K S K S K S K S K S K S K Crazy. Uh, power coal generator. We're all we're ready, boys. We're ready for this coal generator to go in. That's right. Okay, let's get some uh wire to this. Going out like this, and then up and connecting to the rest of the network. It's good. All of the building jobs and the digging jobs are done. That's nice. Let's dig out here, and then let's also build a tile here. This is going to be the piss pit down here. We're starting to work on the piss pit. It's good. It's real good. Mmm, good. Feels good. Smells good. Marine core. Oh. Maybe. Is this new from yesterday? It is, yeah. It is. Maybe put a tile to the left of the water pump as a piss barrier. It keeps the eventual piss that will end up on the floor by the musher. Put a tile to the left of the water pump as a piss barrier. It keeps the eventual piss that will end up on the floor by the musher. Oh. Does piss end up on the floor by the musher? Does that happen? I don't think I've ever seen that happen before. I don't think I've ever seen piss drip out of the musher. You might be right though. You might actually be right. Okay, so, so we're gonna try to eat up all the CO2 that makes it to I'm the bottom sorry, of the I base. Have to. The sprinkler goes... A row for train goes... TCHDVTXT. <laughs> okay, thanks, Levia. <laughs> thanks for that. It's alright. 
I understand the need to, to do that from time to time. Thank you very much. I appreciate it. <laughs> T-C-H-D-V-D-X-T. <laughs> nice. I like that. All right. One of our shitters is out of commission. We have to, uh, to sort it out. We are now processing some of the CO2 that's making it to the bottom of the base. Uh, we are not getting enough um, O2 rising to the top of the base either. We're going to have to get some airflow stuff in. Uh, but that's fine. We can do that. Uh, and we're starting to excavate excavate our, uh, our, our, our piss pit. We're doing, it, we're doing it piecemeal for now. We're doing it slowly. We're doing it very lentement. Because um, we want to make sure that it's, um, it's, it's good. We want to make sure that it's really good. Uh, we would also like to put a mesh tile here. Um, but we don't have mesh tiles just yet. Or is it in plumbing? No, it's not. Ventilation. We have. And we can do composting now too. Which we're going to need to think about doing pretty soon. Let's dig out here. And let's also add some tiles this away. We'll get some compost over here, I think. Perfecto. We should have some coal for the generator. Which means that Toxicaro shouldn't need to run on that hamster wheel. We have one battery. Probably you'd do with having some more batteries. Okay, good. Okay, let's wire these bad boys up. Research complete. Wonderful. So that's pressure management. So that's airflow tile. That's just what we needed. That's nice. Uh, we'll do plumbing next. Great. Yeah, like the one tile high wall. Someone eventually pissed themselves after a meal and it will run into your good water. We're going to try to avoid that. You might be right though. The idea is to avoid that. Uh, athletics, cooking, creativity, and learning. Farming, cooking, kindness, ranching, construction. Farming, digging, and tickering, but a uh, squeamish mouth breather. We have somebody here who is afraid of digging. Bottomless gut and unconstructive. Okay, we're going to just reject all of these guys. We'll wait for the next cycle to come in. I don't think those guys are any good. I think we're fine for now anyway. We don't need any more, any more dudes. Tell you what we do need is we need some coal to be delivered to the old um, generator. That would be pretty good. Start making some electricity. Yeah. Get him to do a big wave instead. What do you mean, Krelly? My name is pretty nice, and I'd love to be a colonist named Ben Dover, preferably the piss boy. Okay, sure. Why did you restart? What happened? We had piss everywhere. We had to restart. There's too much piss. We couldn't keep on top of the uh, massive amount of piss. So we had to start over. Uh, before we do anything, we are going to um, put a uh, liquid output uh, here. And then we'll continue to dig down and make our big piss pit. We're going to have to get a uh, pump down there as well. Make sure that we can pump uh, some pipes in and out and stuff as well. And we'll start working on getting the bathrooms up and running. That'd be good. Nobody is emptying out this commode. Worrying. Oh, it's break and nap time, though. Your lunch is about to end, Jess. Jeez. When you reject people, do they die? I don't think so. You just get, like, another selection Hi, next time. Hi, Reddit here. Michael is ruining the stream. <laughs> Please raise TTS limit to 4 million rupees. Okay. 4 million rupees it is. All right, come on, go to the toilet. Don't have an accident, Stero, dude. We want to have a hundred percent rate of uh, not non-accidents. That's what we're aiming for here. Okay, one of the toilets is out of commission. Yes, but tomorrow is a new day. It's a new dawn and it's a new day, and hopefully, with any luck, we can get this other toilet online, and then nobody will feel the need to piss on the floor. I'm prioritizing this work. Okay. It's really important. Somebody's got to go do it. 
Somebody's gonna have to get in there and fix this toilet. Alright, good. Somebody has decided to do it. Wonderful. That's just what we needed. Okay, let's dig this out too. Red Skeg is gasping for breath after doing some underwater work. Nice. And these guys are, are such good workers. Really the best. <laughs> the fucking plunging out the toilets. Nice. You will piss in the water. Do not do it, Stero Dude. We're gonna kick you off of this team so so hard if you piss in the water. That's one thing we will not we will not take you. There's no jails or anything in this game, is there? There's no way to imprison a colonist who's been bad. You're not allowed to do that. I'm surprised that we don't have any coal. Anyone else surprised by this? Research, pressure management. Um, what do we want to do next? Meal preparation, potentially. Uh, brute force refinement, no filtration, uh, refined objects, smelting, liquid tuning. Liquid tuning is what gives us thermo aqua tuner, radiant liquid pipe, and a liquid tepidizer. Warms large bodies of liquid. Must be fully submerged. So what, we could just put this into our water source and it's just going to warm up all the water and kill the germs? I like that. Um, decontamination I think we want next. So we'll go into sanitation. Sanitation. Liquid tuning is more endgame. Alright. I don't think I've ever, ever researched it. So I don't know. You're doing great, Dad. I've never been in a Sips game. Please name a fabricant after me. Sups, please. I love piss. Love <laughs> it. Thank you. Who doesn't? God, I love piss as well. It's fantastic. Viva la piss. That's what I say. I say viva la piss. Okay. Let's get some airflow going here so that we can get some more of this beautiful, breathable oxygen up a ways, the base. Get this horrible CO2 down here into this, into these terrariums. I think that's the way forward, right? Or am I wrong about that? You love it. Love it. You love it. Elliot CM, thanks so much for the donation, man. I appreciate it. And Joey676, thanks so much for the bits, too. Much appreciated. Thanks to both of you. Thanks. Thanks so much. Okay. A couple of airflow tiles have been installed. And things are starting to to look good. Things are starting to look good in this base here now. Um, so that means that plumbing is done. So we can get our liquid vent here. We're going to put it... It's not quite in the middle, I realize. But we're going to put it here. And this is where all the piss is going to drip out. Okay. So that means that we're also going to want to have um, some liquid pipes connecting up to here at least so that we can then make more liquid pipes and then we can start working on our bathroom. That's the idea. That is the big idea. Also, we're going to want to have a uh, mesh tile. So we're going to have to get sanitation research, which we're working on right now. Uh, and we are going to also want a bottle emptier. Bottle emptier will go here of all places. Nuts, eh? And then we will drop piss down into this piss um, lake as well. No? Need a bigger piss room? It's going to be big, don't worry. It's going to be the biggest piss room you've ever seen. You'll never see a bigger piss room, trust me. You might see a bigger piss room. La piscine. <laughs> yeah. I think this game should be renamed into Piss Included. Yes. <laughs> yeah, I think it should be too. I think this game should be called Piss Included. Because this game is filled with piss. There's just piss everywhere. It's all about piss management. They should call this Piss Management Simulator 2018. But you know what? I love it. I love managing the piss. 
I like I like piss too. Have I ever gone over to the Oxalite Hearthstone yet? No, I haven't. It's still here. We'll go over there eventually, I guess. We're, we're in no rush. We're good. Okay, this... We can stop making this stuff now. We have plenty of food for now. So let's stop. The commodes have been taken care of. We're gonna want to have uh, some compost heaps in here too. Put them here. Jobs mastered. Who mastered a job? It looks like we have a master builder. 